Hello YouTube, I thought I'd do you a quick video and do the next of the Motorbike Community Think Biker Challenge which is K for Knowledge and share some of my some of my tips. So the first one I thought I'd show you is uh, these things here, these are um, tyre pressure monitor caps which um, go on your obviously your tyres um, and what you do is you when you order them you order the correct um, pressure you can see this one's 34 which goes on the front and I have another one on the back I don't know if you can watch see that that one says 36 and basically how it works it's a bit like a traffic like system in that um, when the uh, tire pressure starts going down it starts going from green which is obviously fully inflated uh, then down to yellow and or amber and then when it's really low, it uh, shows you red. Now obviously this one's red because um, it's off the tyre, but if I um, put it back on the tyre, you'll see exactly how it works. Um, they're really, really quite cheap. And, um, you know, I'm quite lazy when it comes to motorcycle maintenance. So any any shortcut, there you go. That's how it goes on. You can see it's, well, it's starting to come down to red, so maybe that one's about due to be inflated but you can see the principle uh, the one on the back and if you can see that is fully inflated that's all green so that one's okay so yeah I thought I'd just uh, show that to you um, and they were really really cheap these were I think I got them from Amazon they're only a few quid and like I say when you order them you tell them exactly the um, the, the number that you need for each of your, your dust caps and um, they, they come ready set so they're excellent other thing I'd show you are some surgical gloves. Now, don't get too excited. Um, what I use these for, and I actually got this tip from Huggy Brin, is if you're riding throughout the winter and you've got some winter gloves which aren't particularly waterproof, if you put these on first, and obviously put your glove on, on top of that, it will uh, hopefully keep your hands nice and dry. So uh, that's a tip there from uh, Huggy Brin 69. Uh, the other tip he showed me was, um, any of you guys have got a HD ghost camera, you've probably noticed that as you're using your batteries, they start to um, start to um, expand and, and they become very difficult to um, get inside the uh, the casing. I mean, this one's all right. So Huggy Brin told me about uh, putting a bit of uh, dental floss around it, which I've started to do a lot now, and uh, that way. Uh, it makes it a hell of a lot easier to get the uh, battery out, but uh, this one's okay because it's still quite loose. But I know my other batteries have had them quite some time now, and uh, they're starting to get quite difficult to get out. And this is a sort of great tip to uh, get them out. So uh, yeah, there's three tips for you. Anyway, guys, I think I'll do for now. So as always, uh, think bike, think biker, and I'll catch you next time. Thank you.